Before we get started, let's check out the links in my description. We all want nice things. We want the car, we want a house, we want a high limit credit card. But if you don't have at least a 680 credit score, you're not even in the game. So click this link here to know where you stand and get your free credit scores from all three bureaus. That will be Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax. And also get your reports. If you would like to be free and become financially independent through entrepreneurship, click this link here to be free. If you'd like to get cash back, which is a discount during shopping, please click this link here to see my favorite cash back sites. And if you enjoy the music you hear in the background, please click the link here and subscribe to It's Oasi. Hello everyone, welcome back to Community Wealth. Today what I'm going to do is I'm going to request benefits again. This is actually the last week to request the benefits. Remember the benefits are supposed to expire the week of the 13th. And here it is the last week. So I'm going to go ahead and request these benefits. And I believe, well, I went ahead, I started and what's happening is it's showing that we're going through a quarter change okay so there are quarter change questions and so we're going to go through the quarter change question which is why i'm doing this video otherwise i wouldn't be doing it because i already have a few requests benefit benefit request tutorials i already have a few of those videos but since there's another quarter change happening i'm going to go and do the quarter change question because they look a little different. So I'm going to do that in this and I guess I'll go through the rest of the tutorials from here. Okay, so let me go ahead and go through the benefits request and you will see the questions. Of course you got to click acknowledge. Okay, so here are the questions here. Please respond to the below quarter change questions to confirm you are not monetarily eligible for a regular state reemployment assistance RA benefits claim in Florida or any other state. Once you have completed the questions, click submit. What is your primary occupation? Check which applies. I work for another person or employer as an employee. I am self-employed as a sole proprietor, partner, corporate officer, gig worker, or as an independent contractor. I am self-employed in the fishing industry. I am self-employed as a farmer. So you're gonna click that, because this is for the PUA, so you can't be an employee, all right? Did you work in the third quarter of 2020, July, August, and September? No. Did you earn any wages in the state of Florida during the third quarter of 2020, July, August, and September? No. If you say yes to question three, please enter the amount of gross wages you were paid during the third quarter of 2020, July, August, and September. I didn't answer yes, so next. Did you earn any wages in a state other than Florida during the third quarter of 2020, July, August, and September? No. If you said yes to question five, please enter the amount of gross wages you were paid during the third quarter of 2020, July, August, and September. Answer no, so. Next. Were these wages earned as an independent contractor, sole proprietor, or gig worker? Earn your wages, so there's no. Please list the name of the employer or business you worked for in the third quarter of 2020.
was the address of the employer or business you listed in question eight. All right. See, the funny part about this is they have an asterisk next to this. I don't understand why, because if you do not earn any wages, why would they have an asterisk right here? Like this question has to be answered. They should have the way you skip this. Because you didn't earn any wages in the third quarter. So. I don't get it so anyway we're gonna go ahead and submit this because all of these questions you know I answered everything and there's no answer to eight because I didn't earn anything in the third quarter so. Okay. So, go ahead and submit. Okay, so once you complete the uh, quarter change questionnaire, you're going to say that you completed and you're going to click next. You're going to confirm your direct deposit information and everything, and then you're going to be brought here to these questions again. Did you look for work? Yes. Did you make an in-person contact at a career source center? No. Were you able and available to work if work had been offered? Yes. No. Did you refuse any work? Did you work or earn any money? No. Did you receive or apply for income from any other source that you have not previously reported to us? Are you still unemployed? Yes. And if the answer is yes to five, you choose one of these. I was an independent contractor and the COVID-19 public health emergency severely limited my ability to continue performing my customary work activities. Next. Agree. Well, I'm not going to go through this whole thing because it's going to make the video long, but you guys pretty much know what I did. If you guys have been doing, uh, if, you have, if you guys have been requesting benefits before, you pretty much know how this goes. I just, I was just really showing you the, uh, the questionnaire, the quarter change questionnaire that they have going on. So I'm going to go ahead and finish requesting benefits. I'm going to cut the video short here and, uh, you know, subscribe, share, stay tuned for the next video. Subscribe to Isoasi. Check out the links in the description. And yo, let's get this money. All right. Later.